Tufts University Music Department is a community of musical omnivores. So um, we kind of eat music for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, but, uh, but we do it in a lot of different ways. So we might have a scholarly way into it, we might have a performative way into it, we might, have, we might be composers. Um, so it's kind of celebrating all those ways of making music. What identifies us um, from someplace else that's a music school is that we are a department of music and a liberal arts institution. The All Night Concert was a concert that we put together that consisted of 42 student and faculty and Tufts adjacent acts. It was a, a first for us in the sense that it was so um, pervasive. We encouraged um, campus music making groups that are not faculty sanctioned. It was like a big nightclub party with no, no booze, no and, and everybody had a, a great time. That's how I think it was successful. It was one of the, the best events I've been to on campus because so many people from different clubs and different years and different majors heard about it and, and either had friends they came to support or were just interested in the idea of an all-night music festival. Was, for the very first time, the music department sponsored an event that included non-music department ensembles as well as other performers who don't necessarily usually interface with us in a direct way. Boston area. There's plenty of conservatories that do Western classical music and jazz. There's plenty of colleges that have liberal arts programs that have maybe one or two non-Western genres that they offer, but I think that we have quite a, quite a diverse uh, offering here at Tufts Music. And I'm not, I'm not sure that other music departments in the Boston area do such a thing. Not just the music majors, but the dual degree students and people who just take music classes at Tufts or participate in ensembles regardless of their major are really involved in lots of things that spread to kind of the greater reaches of Boston. So just by being a Tufts student who's interested in music, we kind of expand throughout the whole city. One of the main events of the festival was a live stream Twitter feed we had projected on the wall of the music building. People who were performing could tweet that their performance was coming up, people could tweet that they were loving the food or that they just took an awesome photo at the photo booth and it kind of was a, a unifying social media tool which worked really well for us. I think it kind of gave us a little more exposure and that we're not just in an academic department and that it's fun. It's, you know, I think people want to make music here. Created enough of a splash that I think we're kind of beholden to doing it again. There are a lot of students who are very passionate about different subjects and different arts, and the resulting music culture is really diverse and interesting, and we really wanted to celebrate that. We want them to feel like this is part of the advantage they can have um, while they're at Tufts. Use these facilities, perform here, um, so we're trying to create a forum for that. This was a wildly successful event because it made the music department shine brightly, very brightly.